and welcome to Spangly Nails YouTube. My name is Nicole and in today's video we're going to be doing seven different nail art designs that only require a dotting tool. As you can see dotting tools come in all different shapes and sizes and they are cheapest chips to come by. I see them in the pound shop all the time and I also see them on eBay for around the same price. So without further ado, I'm just going to jump straight into the first design. I'm going to use a medium sized dotting tool for the first design. I'm going to start by dipping my tool in white polish and making five dots in a circle shape and these are our petals. Fill up the entire nail as much as you can with your five dot system. It doesn't matter if you have to go off the nail for five dots or you can only fit in two or three. This gives the illusion that the pattern is continuing. To make the centre, use a gold polish and the same dotting tool and just add one dot of that polish in the centre or go one step further like I've done here and add a gold stud. Clean up any mesh you've made and finish off with a fast drying top coat and that is design number one. For the second design, I'm going to use my large dotting tool but not quite yet. I'm going to start off by using a tan toned polish and making a small V sized shape towards the bottom half of my nail. I'm just going in for two coats of this because that first coat wasn't too opaque for my liking. Now using the dotting tool dipped in pink polish, I'm going to make three large dots straight across the top of that V. Then using the brush of the pink polish, I'm going to manipulate that into a sort of circle slash half circle on top of those dots to make the top of the ice cream. This is all about working with your polish brush, the tools that you already have rather than grabbing for a nail art brush that you might not have. You might need to add a couple of coats depending on the pink polish that you're using for full opacity. Finally, I'm using this Pop Art by Nails Ink polish that I have got from a couple of years ago and I'm popping that on top of the pink polish to act as hundreds and thousands or sprinkles or whatever else you can get on ice cream and I'm just spreading that around using a small dotting tool but if you don't have that kind of polish you can use glitter or use dots of different coloured polish it's completely up to you because all you need is a dotting tool finish off with a fast drying top coat and that's design number two for the design you're going to need two dotting tools a large one and a small one using the large one dipped in a sort of lightly tan toned polish I'm going to make large random circles, blodges, whatever you want to call them all over the nail and then with a the small dotting tool I'm going to make small C shapes round about those original tanned dots. These don't need to be perfect, the more random the better actually. And then I'm going to fill in the negative space on the nail as well with just random dots and lines and shapes and what have you. This has got to be the easiest design out of the seven. Finish off with a fast drying top coat and you're done. For the fourth design, I'm going to use a small dotting tool and some white polish and I think I might have lied, I think this might be the easiest one, not the previous. Anyway, to make clouds on your nails, all you do is you dip the tool into white polish and make groups of around six or seven dots, similar to the first design we've done, the flowers, except if you want to make them further apart, more horizontal, and you get a real illusion of clouds. Add a fast drying top coat and you're done. For the fifth design I'm going back to my large dotting tool and I've looked out a gradient effect of polishes here. I've gone with five but if you've got longer nails you could use seven or shorter nails you could use three. And starting off with the darkest shade I'm making a large dot near the cuticle and I'm following that all the way down to the tip of the nail going from dark down to light. This effect looks best over a nude polish and you just finish off with a fast drying top coat and you're done. On to the sixth design, you're going to need a medium and a small size dotting tool and then an assortment of your favourite colours. Starting with a pale base colour, just make random dots from the tip of your nail up towards the cuticle getting smaller. And this is what you call a dot of dot cure if I could actually say it. I've gone with some quite bright colours here, I think this would be quite nice for spring. But like I said, use the medium dotting tool at the tip and then the smaller one nearer the cuticle. 
there's no right or wrong way of doing this. Put down as much dots as you think you would like. Use more than me or use less. It's completely up to yourself. And finish off with your top coat. For the final design, I am using my large and small dotting tool, but not just yet. Again, I'm going to be using the brush that comes with the polish, and I'm going to cover the top half of my nail with my chosen colour. The line at the top doesn't need to be clean or straight or anything like that because that's where we're going to put the dots. So straight across that, I'm making a line of dots, taking that all the way up to near the cuticle in an arch shape and all the way back down again, joining them up and filling it in. I'm going to make a cherry on the top with my large dotting tool and then in the centre I'm going to pop some small dots with different coloured polish for the hundreds and thousands again, or the sprinkles, or whatever else you get in cupcakes. <laughs> and I'm finishing off with a fast drying top coat. So go ahead and leave me a comment down below letting me know which one was your favourite. Flowers, clouds, leopard print ice cream, dotted cure gradient line or cupcakes. Send me any of your recreations on Facebook, Instagram or Twitter. I'm all at Spangly Meals. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to subscribe and give me a great big thumbs up and I will see you guys all next time. Bye!